good morning and welcome to my channel um as you can see i'm in a view and it's super early and i normally don't wake up this early well i try to I made sure to take a shower last night and stuff but here's a get rid of me for a job interview and it's josh's company um they need a new sales girl and i thought why not you know it'll give me more money to you know so i can get better stuff for this channel and so I can, you know, get better editing stuff. So I am getting this job so I can get a better camera and a better laptop and um, more inventory for my website. And so I can buy my own clothes so I can wear my own clothes so y'all can see and everything. And then this little spot is a bleach spot, so... But, uh, yeah, I want to get more stuff and want to be able to wear my own clothing because I feel like if you're going to, you know, run your own business and stuff, you need to wear what you um, provide so people can, you know, it's kind of like advertising for yourself. And that's another thing. I need, like, more business cards and better advertising stuff. So, with all that said, let's get started. Okay, um, just so it's not dead quiet and stuff, I just want to kind of recap what I did with my makeup. Um, I'm just messing with a lot of golds and browns and um, dark colors on the outer corner. And I kind of did a smudge effect on the eyeliner and kind of make it that soft, um, grungy, you know, feather-like look around the eyes. Not really harsh eyeliner or under eyeliner try to make it all smudged out because it is fall and it's you know that season to where you know you get the really grunge look so yep okay I'm gonna clean this side up because I got some mascara a little bit too much mascara on so or you know what you know what this is easy you take a clean brush and we're gonna smudge it out a little bit more to break it up your foundation brush that you've used. There you go. It's a little bit more cleaned up. It's a lot better looking. Na, 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 na. So now we're gonna go and do our hair. Okay, and normally with my hair, you know, I just straighten out, go straight out from the hair, or straight out from your head, so you can get it nice and straight, because if you go straight down, you actually still have bumps in your hair, so when you go straight out from the hair, from your head, it actually gets your hair straighter, and creates more volume. So, yeah, that's what I did. Okay, and there's the hair and makeup part. Um, I always like to keep it simple and as like down to earth makeup and hair as possible. You know, try to look like a girl next door and just, you know, try to look sweet and nice and, you know, look the part, which I'm going to be doing customer service, so I'm pretty sure they want somebody that's a little, you know, that's like, you know, some someone sweet looking. So I got my bangs to the side in this. So let me go put a bra and some clothes on and I'll show you all the finished look. Okay, I'll show y'all right here since this is okay lighting. But yeah, my makeup, I try to stay with some gold and then brown in the crease and then a little bit of a darker, like not black, but a darker brown on the outside. My eyebrows are actually shaped up pretty nice, so I'm proud of my eyebrows here lately. Um, I need to put on some more chapstick and I don't think I need lipstick. I always like to put on chapstick just because interview is not, it's subtle and I feel like my lips are pink enough especially with this natural look. My eyes are already bold for an interview, so I don't want my lips to be bold. So, yep. And then I got my chiffon lace um, cardigan with a tank top and a racer back bra, and then some jeans. And I'm trying to pick out which shoes I wanna wear, cause I'm not, I'm not sure. Maybe some Sperry's. Uh, or I guess some flip flops, but my toes aren't done. Okay, so even though it's a dirty mirror, these are my boots I'm wearing, even though the mirror's all dirty, so you can't really see. So thank you, mirror, for being dirty. But these are kind of like some biker boots that I have on. Woo! 
that I'm wearing. So yeah, let's ace this. Which that's not really flattering either, but yay! I'm excited to go get a job that's actually like makes money. Cause this is technically an oil field job, but um, it's uh, welding, and I'm gonna be doing a lot of like selling oil field parts and stuff. And I have like a really big um, experience and retail and sales and all that so hopefully they hire me just for that reason and yeah so I'm excited I'm pretty sure I have this in the bag but I don't want to give my hopes up I do want to try and you know get out of my comfort zone and have more experience with jobs and I feel like this would help me in a way because if I ever get fired or anything at a you know at a salon later on I can work for you know, oil field and stuff, so I'm excited. So I'm looking good. I'm gonna take some selfies on Snapchat. Okay, so I think I'm just gonna end it here. So thank you for watching, and I believe this look will give me my job and give you your job. So if you do follow this look, let me know if it's, let me know if this is your go-to look for interviews, cause this is mine. I feel nice. So, if you're going on a job interview, good luck to you. So, thank you for watching.